thanks so much for staying with us on Suncoast FYI. Joining us now are Venice Eye Specialist, Dr. Trent McKinney and RN Christy McKinney, and they're here to share their exciting new business advancements. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Thank so you. please, uh, let's start with what, what is the hallmark, you would say, of your practice? I would say the uh, hallmark of the practice is probably a reflection of uh, my personal passion to teach and educate patients. I think that if uh, with videos, handouts, but most importantly just chair time, spending time with them, they become empowered, they become mm -hmm. involved, and with an empowered, involved patient, they're more likely to be compliant with their care and they will be successful in treatment in general. Mm -hmm. I think it's very important for people to understand because it's such a a delicate, crucial part of mm -hmm. who we are that, you know, to know what's going on and to truly understand it, exactly. that's, that's great. That's, that's great. So moving forward, what are the next big steps that you have in your practice? So, you know, moving forward, the we've always been patient-centered eye care practice, mm -hmm. but we want to complement that with a facility that is also warm and inviting. So we are currently in our, um, we have currently purchased a building and undergoing res renovations that mm -hmm. will allow us to create an environment that is is inviting it will uh, showcase artwork by a local um, creator um, uh, north by south creations it will also uh, showcase things of natural entities woods and stones so we'll have a, a reef a saltwater reef aquarium uh, and the whole point um, of this whole this whole yeah. process is to create this uh, environment that will reflect the practice's new name of moving forward which will be always as I care Okay, so what is the new name of your practice? Oasis Eye Care. Oasis Eye Care. Okay. So that, okay. that earthy, beachy feel. All know. right, all right. Well, yes, I mean, we live here, and that's why everybody <laughs> loves it here, so you might as well embrace it as much as you can. Um, so coming up with your new expansion, you're going to have new services and procedures then that you're going to offer? Yep. Yes, we're really about um, excited about this. Um, one thing that we're looking into is hiring another eye care specialist mm -hmm. that can help us offer some more services like contact lenses and just give the patients more accessibility to care. What's really exciting though is the new equipment that we're going to be purchasing. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to be joining the practice and helping to educate patients on dry eye care um, and really teaching them about what that is mm -hmm. and also offering those treatments so um, and also what's really cool with this this new equipment is that it has 30 different things that it can do for skin care that's a little bit later down the road but we okay. really want to focus on a dry eye med spa okay dry eye med spa so yeah. can you tell us just a little bit about what dry eyes what causes yeah. that yeah so dry is a very chronic condition mm -hmm. it probably takes about 60 percent of my patients have this condition and for a long time it's basically just clinical looking uh, talking about it and having home remedies whether it's tears uh, prescription eye drops okay. warm compress nauticeuticals but we want to take it a step further with this diagnostic equipment we'll be okay. able to pinpoint the the problem okay. whether it's a tear problem oil production problem you know tear dynamics things like that is there any way to avoid that not really, because unfortunately, as we age, our bodies go through changes. Sure. And with the technology today, what's happening is we, we, we tend to do a lot less blinking, and they think that has a lot to do with it. Mm -hmm. And the medications we are on, and all these things kind of just coincide together in creating a very dry environment around the sure. eye. So with the med spa, we will be able to actually use clinical treatments for the first time, taking the treatment okay. away from the home, bring it into the spa, with uh, intense pulse light therapies, lid massaging, things like that, and actually break the cycle. Awesome, awesome. Now you have um, other things that you're gonna be doing. What, what else do you do with your patients that you're particularly fond of, other than the, you the know, clinical. practice, yeah, your clinical side? I'm so proud of my husband because he has such a passion for people in the community mm -hmm. and he does things with the Lions Club offering some free services to, to people who can't afford it and then works with the Senior Friendship Center and um, helps to provide with some low cost um, exams there and helping them to get their medication. Some of the medications are just so expensive. Yeah. Yeah. Um, we are also both very involved with our children's school, Laurel mm -hmm. Nacomas. Um, 
with our time and resources, mm -hmm. we, we give back to other local schools That's too. That's wonderful. One of my favorite things though is that we're involved in our church and just even in August before school started, we helped with eye screenings for kids going back to school through Hope Kids and it was just such a great experience. Thank you. Yeah. Thank Absolutely. you, really. That's 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 awesome. It's always so nice to hear, you know, that business people take the time to really get involved with their community and, and give help back. them. So we appreciate that. So can you tell our viewers again the name of your new business and uh, where they can go to find you online? Yeah. So the new practice name is going to be always the Eye Care. Okay. Obviously, with the dry thought in mind, uh, our website is VeniceEyeDoctors.com. And it will remain that, even though we changed the name. That way it's easy to find us still. Great. Great. Well, thank you both for being Appreciate here. It. And best of luck with your new ventures. Thanks. Thank you. Suncoast FYI will be right back after a quick break.